a generator. <laughs> All right, mount the uh, the LMG, the light machine gun. Good thing I came strapped for this. I need mean, stay oh, wait, behind no, they're me. They're small. They're tiny. Oh god, they're it's, all coming it's that along. That Willy Wonka thing I was talking about last time we oh. were here. <laughs> Hell yeah! I didn't realize that would actually come back Die, around. Die monsters! It's like getting attacked by a bunch of kids in a playground. How many yeah, of you can I kill before him. going down? I don't have ever gone. My punches and kicks will literally just smash you. Your bones will be broken. God forbid, God forbid I should have brought an axe to the playground brawl. They're running away, they know the day is lost. Eileen, did you see me? Did you see how I beat up all those children? Die, victim! That's pretty cool, right? Yeah, I guess I just killed all the victims of the cult, maybe, is the thing. <laughs> you or just maybe slaughtered it was just an entire excuse orphanage. to use the Willy Wonka optical illusion. Yeah. That's, That's a podcast title for there. you. Slaughtered an orphanage in the Willy Wonka hallway. <laughs> All right, Building World, you're next on my shit list. <laughs> Points at Building World. Building <laughs> World sweats nervously. It's like he's calling his shot, his home run shot. I don't understand why baseball players don't just bring an axe instead of a bat. So you could just like split the ball and the game would be won. It would be over. There's no more playing baseball after that. Yeah, what like you just, your team ball? just won the game. Yeah, go ahead. Get another ball. I'll chop it in half. I'll chop that one, too. Just you watch. I practiced, actually. I practiced swinging the axe. I'm going to chop it in at half. At baseballs. You're, You're fucking back. back. <laughs> what the fuck? That's right. My baby wall is back. Seems like there's a safe distance here. They're on spiritual attack. Yeah, that's fine. My baby wall is back. They're on the spiritual attack, and I don't have the wax to see them gone. I, I, uh, viewers, I just want to caution you. Don't blink in this sec next segment because you might miss me speed running Building World of Silent Hill 4 The Room. Don't blink in general. And a actually, though, you know, I wasn't going to say this, but some inside baseball. The reason why I went to that bathroom, even though I didn't need to, is I set the state of the game to be ready for a pretty impressive tech that'll show up mm -hmm. later on. When you hear him button mashing, that's him uh, executing that. <laughs> Henry will be doing this really funny thing where he's like like spinning around in circles. Um, and then, and then uh, Andy has to pause it at just the right moment. Um, yeah, we're gonna Henry use the and Arlene just go shooting down through the, the floor. I mean, you're trying to go down this whole time. Like, every world is down, so why don't you just dig a hole? Why don't I just jump? It's or a jump, dream. Yeah. What's jump, gonna happen? and then when you can't jump anymore, just dig. Dig until you right, can I'm... jump again. 
I'm digging building world so far. It gives me a cutscene as soon as I enter. All right, you're setting the stakes. There's Richard. Richard, boy, Richard. The diary. diary. I want to go back to that time. Things were so good then. The day of my birthday. The cute cat in the pet store. All those balls in the basket. Playing pool was fun too. The door of time was wide open. Kingdom Hearts? When I see four things, yeah. I can't help but remember that time. Same. It's For me, it's six things, but yeah, I feel the same. The hell was hmm. that? <laughs> Eileen, are you, are you making that noise? <laughs> oh, Richard. Oh. That's Richard. Richard's making the glitch. Glitch noise. Well, generally don't know if that's supposed to be happening or if that's an emulator thing. I haven't well, had any was... emulator things. Right. He was like, his, physically, he was like glitching out like 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 stuttering i think that's just his ghost effect i remember this place it looks a lot like downtown ashfield it is down, downtown ashfield as far as we know I don't know how well I remember fence. building world. Well, you crushed it so easily last time. You're right, I got a reputation to live up to. When you switched to the map, I thought you just activated a cutscene by hitting the fence. Button, button. Who's got the button? You may be 21, 21 is Walter and he's gonna kill himself. Uh -huh. Although he did die already, but then he can do it again. So did. Did Richard teleport from down there to up here, or is that? Yeah, I just saw him do that. Okay, that's cool. Well, like I saw, I saw him down there, and then all of a sudden he yeah. was up here. That's a fun. Uh, I, I, I'm assuming they, they, like, programmed that in. Like that's supposed to happen right at that spot, because that, that is cool. If that's an emergent gameplay, then that's even cooler. But I don't think it is. Double dog. Double dog down. Double dog down. <gasps> what was that? that a, a dying cat. Big ass cat. That was a megaphone or some kind of PSA system. Someone's just playing a soundboard. It's either Kurt, Zach, or Knoxville messing around. <laughs> Clubs. Powerful clubs. I see another club. 
Henry's just unwilling. Cake candles. Y'all grow candles for putting on a birthday cake. So obviously, you know, we may learn more birthday centric information, but so far the number of this level that like the number related to this level was that first diary entry said four every time he sees mm -hmm. four. Yeah, what could that mean? Whoa. That was that was neat. Yeah. That was cool because I was just standing there after running around the room for a while and he shows up. Yeah. Richard's got some ghost chops. You've got some human chops with the axe, but he's got some chops. I don't even notice it so quick because I was looking at my inventory for what I got and I noticed the Saints Medallion start flashing. I was like, what? <laughs> he, yeah, he literally just popped in behind you. Ew. Dude, that's where I sleep. So yeah, that's a that's a straight up that's that ghost. <laughs> ghost is just here. Yeah, I was waiting to see if he comes out. Is he stuck? Do we need to attempt a rescue operation? Jaws of life. You just like <laughs> you just like open his jaw and stuff the candle in there. Would you stop coming out of my walls? It's unsanitary. Things are maybe starting to get a little desperate in the Henry household. Henry's gonna lose his fucking deposit. Absolutely, dude. There's no chance of he's getting that back. Your medallion. No. That's the bathroom. You always turn left, and you've taken to going back into the bathroom for safety. <laughs> yep. God, this place is haunted as fuck. There's every room leave now. Me. I need to leave. I had a real quiet before the storm moment there, you know. Like the last time I was here, I mean. Sure, sure. Getting rid of... He, he thought you had done. He thought you were over and done with it. I thought so. But I was wrong. I wouldn't seem to do, do well with staircases. Maybe it's because if it calculates like a linear distance, I'm never that far from her. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. She can move her feet good. Oh, Christina. Cynthia. Oh, Cynthia, yeah. And tracksuit guy. You've been, you were here before. I'm sort of pissed off. I keep clicking no, and then they're pushing me away from the item. Just don't click that. Don't click no, lol. Don't don't click no. LOL. They were like fucking bullying me. Like they were literally sandwiching me so I couldn't move. Maybe you just have like a bullyable disposition. Did you ever think of that? Yeah. And her, and her leg hurts. Are you even thinking of that? No. I'm a bad boyfriend. <laughs> Henry, carry me. I wish. God, I wish. <laughs> I 
and read. Oh. This is different. No, this is totally the way it was before. What are you talking about? The, God, this is so hard to control. It was it was an upside down room, but not this way. <laughs> no, you're right. And the camera does not like this idea that the developers have put in. Uh, did you know that the camera actually quit Team Silent after this game? Like, I'm not even moving it. It's moving itself. And it's so fucking disorienting. Like, even while I'm not moving, that's what it's doing. I'm not doing anything. At the time, they said there was no bad blood, but a, an interview came out 15 years later um, that revealed that there was some sexual misconduct stuff going on with the camera. Yeah, when you when you play this scene, you see why. Yeah, it was all topsy-turvy at the time, apparently. All right, don't go all fucking infantile on me now. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, when I see four things, I remember the time. So in order to beat this level, I got to set that clock over there correctly. I know the elite so far as I got birthday candles. Just dancing on the ceiling. Can you get up on that ramp towards the clock? Can after I get this ammo. Does the do you think the pistol bullets assume Henry's gravity as soon as he touches them? No, if you notice the pistol bullets were already on my gravity. Like they oh, were they on, were like the on the top of the shelf. Okay. Yeah. I thought the same thing at first, but I didn't comment on it because, like, as soon as I thought that, I immediately stole. Wouldn't they be, a, the if they're on yours, Gravity, wouldn't they have to be on the underside underside of the top shell? Was that what they were? That's what they were, yeah. Okay. I meant the top relative to a normal orientation, not my orientation. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, okay. The game's over. I would like the idea, though, that Henry tries to grab the pistol bullets box and puts them, like, in his pocket, but they just fall out, like, fall to the floor yeah, ceiling. Right. Damn it. This is the worst part of any video game ever made. <laughs> You get to where you think the next step of the puzzle is, and then it's just like, well, I can't do that, so what do I do now? No, no, I meant the, the fucking controls for this area. Oh, so the actual bad. controls, okay. It's so hard to move right now. What if you, Andy, simply turned over physically your entire body and played on the floor, upside down, doing a handstand. Mm, well, limit me to one hand. Because hmm. I would be doing a one-handed handstand. Or just like balance on your head, you know? Or like get one of those, um, are there like devices that can kind of stand you up? Like handstand practice I'm devices, apparatuses? I'm so tired of this fucking bullshit. <laughs> I'm just tired, Eileen. I'm just so tired. Fucking love that they can dart across the room, but it takes Eileen years. What if we just killed Eileen and then she became a ghost and then she would be easier to transport? Yeah. I would love to kill Eileen. To, to make her a ghost, right? For, 
Easier transport. No, I'm gonna call an exorcist. Get rid of her. <laughs> She's like, okay, Henry, I'm a ghost. We can go now. And then you just bring the candle out slowly. Start lighting it with a, a lighter. And then I kill her. Set it on the ground. And I enjoy it. No, I was I was I was making the joke that you, you brought out the candle to exercise her immediately <laughs> after doing the ghost plan. Oh yeah. Yeah. That that was the that was the that's the joke. And I'm gonna I'm gonna stop praying to the Christian God. Mm hmm That's a good step. I don't want him to think that he's gonna bless me by turning my neighbor girlfriend into a ghost. This is not a delightful Casper situation. No, no, it's pretty fucking gross. I, Henry, am not Christina Ritchie and Casper. The movie. I'm getting tired. I'm getting tired. <laughs> you like cut off the groan. To say she's tired. You tired? All right. <laughs> We can take care of that. Just go to sleep. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. To be fair, she doesn't have a room to go back to. Even though your room is in the midst of hauntings, well, at least you get a little bit of a shut eye when you, uh, before you wake up from the, the nightmare. I was just stuck here. She can't take a nap. No, remember, you actually go back in time every time you enter the, the hole, so she has no time oh, to right, rest. Oh, right, 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 that's right. That's right. You're actually robbing her of... Negative time is scary, because, like, if I spend, like, Rest. eight hours there, then I'm waiting, like, eight hours for her to get to the meetup. Yeah, she's in the previous world. Right. She's back in the forest. Henry? Where'd you go? That's right, this old chest now with climbing down ladders. Don't get me wrong, I would love to ditch Eileen to go down some ladders, but to what end? I don't know. Have you actually been able to, like, affect anything puzzle-wise in your time here so far? No. Hmm. I mean, I, well, I, I have the the child camp or the birthday cake candle. That's the only thing. Yeah, you picked up the candles. But I have not discovered a puzzle. Nor do I right now. I guess I have a reason to think there is one. Well, I mean, I, I know there is one, but you know what I mean. The clock was rusted shut. The door was rusted shut behind the clock. The clock. Oh. oh I thought the same thing for the longest time, but reading it just there is a little bit clearer. The door was not rusted shut. Or sorry, the, the door was rushed shut and the clock all I said was the hands aren't moving. Okay. This is gonna be the best speed run. Cause you're doing it slowly so that everyone can see the details. Right. This tech requires going back to the same area three or four times. Mm -hmm. Well, it's not so much that it requires it, but you are being a good host and entertainer by lingering and wandering to make sure everybody kind of absorbs your techniques of speedrunning. That's all I try to do, just be a good host that, yeah. and an entertainer. That's just good television. 
And that's just that's just all it is. One day viewers are happy I get paid. Was that the rare triple axe? Well, it was a pretty good triple axe, I gotta say. I'm gonna do it again. Oh, Whoa. that was just a double. Axe wing, though. Gum head. More like dumb head. More like dead head. I got to totally go to the one gum at the bottom of my shoe head. Yep. My leg hurts. You got the spade. How does the spade compare to the axe? And a sword. Your leg hurts, you're cold, he's coming. He's coming in. Yeah. I mean, is the spade better than the axe? It's hard to believe. I, I might have missed this from earlier. I probably could have got this earlier. Maybe. It's a stabbing weapon. What does that mean? Like, in what context, Eileen? I think Axe wins for me. I didn't see Eileen yeah. said I was too focused on on measuring the spade's power level at a glance. <laughs> you can't trust what your scouter says about the spade. It's a fool's weakness. Maps. 